Hey guys, I'm just going to quickly show you how to get uh, get some BOG and also how to use the uh, DApp platform, BOG.Finance, on your Trust Wallet. So first you want to head over to the apps, then you'll want to type in BOG.Finance. There we go. Now the first thing you want to do here is tap the uh, little Ethereum icon and turn it to Smart Chain. You want to do this before connecting your wallet. So now I've connected my wallet, I can go to Place Limit Order. Now, because I currently have BOG in my account, I'll be able to place a limit order. But if you don't have BOG in your account, just tap this three dot menu and go to buy BOG. Then we'll head over to PancakeSwap. Tap continue. Connect your, your wallet. You're all good to go. You can buy some BOG. Gonna buy some BOG. Make sure you hit this uh, little button here and set the slippage to 3%. And then I'm going to get 0.75 buck from that. So we'll just press swap, confirm the swap. And then Trust Wallet will ask you to check your browser. Once you're happy with that, you can approve. Excellent. And you've just bought yourself some bug. Now what we'll do is we'll go back to bug.finance. We'll double check and go back to Smart Chain on that one. And then we'll go Connect Wallet. Now we'll be able to place a limit order. So let's say I want to buy some cake. I want to buy 0.01 Ethereum, uh, 0.01 BNB worth of cake. I want to wait until it goes down by about 15% against BNB. And the slippage is going to be 0.75. We fill that in automatically for the default tokens. So just checking the order summary here, we want to get a 14.99, which is 15% uh, price change. We're happy with the amount that we're going to get out, 0.267 um, minimum because of the slippage, but 0.269 is the hope. And the current price and everything, now we're going to place the order. Uh, if you haven't already placed an order before, you'll have to approve BOG. It's a different transaction you have to do first. So we're just going to approve. And that's the order placed. Yeah, so if you haven't placed an order before, you'll actually do two transactions, one to approve the BOG and one to place the order. So now our order's pending here. We've got two now. If you want to cancel an order, same sort of thing. You just uh, approve the cancellation. Now, if you want to sell, so we say we ended up with some cake. We don't actually have any cake. Uh, let's see what we have. We have some bog. Say so we want to sell one bog for a price increase of maybe when it goes up 15%. Slippage will be 3% because that's what slippage you need for bog. Uh, and that's the order summary. We'll have to approve the bog first. There's the approval transaction. That's so that we can sell the bog. And we have to place the order. And because we're placing an order to sell bog, it's a sad face. And very quickly, you'll see that we'll get three active orders here. There we go. Our order here has disappeared. Uh, to sell one bog and get out 0.0151 BNB. Change to fills 13.39%. So that's everything. You can see everyone else's orders here. You can head over the charts. You can use the, uh, you can head over to staking. If you've got some, some LPs to take, you can buy bog by clicking this link. And yeah, that's how you use it. Hope this has been helpful.